I'm Brian. And I'm Michelle. And we're cruising with the Colmans. In 2024, we decided to walk the Camino del Norte. Keep watching to take an adventure with us. Hey, Michelle, what is the Camino providing for you today? I don't know. <laughs> but you gotta lean into the Camino every time. Hola, buenos dias. Hello and good morning. From the Camino del Norte in the rain. <gasps> what? We're walking in the rain? So we walked to, um, in 2022, we walked the Via Francigena and that was the summer of heat. In 2023, we had the perfect weather Camino. So in 2024, we get the rainy Camino. If you're still following along, it means you don't mind the rain. And it means you don't mind that we took a bus again this morning. <laughs> we slept in, a, it said 83% chance of rain and we saw the clouds and we're like, nope, nope, nope. It's been raining since well before we got up. We took a bus ahead a little bit, so we're walking. I don't know. We're not walking that far, but it like was six or eight kilometers total. Today. It was what we could do with the bus on our Camino Real. Oh gosh, translates to our Royal Camino. We found a palace to sleep in tonight. We were supposed to do bunk beds, <laughs> and I'm not feeling them. We've got some coming up, and I'm really emotionally gearing up for them. But this has been more of a solo Camino, so the bunk beds have been hard. Um, but Brian tantalized me with, um, tantalized sounds wrong. I know. So I'm doing the eyebrows. <laughs> no one can see your eyebrows. Just to think, radiant flower, you do not have to come with me to the Casbah. We are already here. Anyway, he showed me a spa. And for the price, it came with. Well, the total package that we did was spa for not uh, massages, but like Turkish bath and stuff for a couple hours, dinner and breakfast. And a room. Sing gluten. Um, so, yeah, we couldn't pass it up. I think it's going to be beautiful. And so in today's video, you're going to see a little bit of walking, but it's raining. So, yeah. Um, and you're going to see a palace apparently the pictures make it look like it's going to be bougie anything better than last night last night i felt like i was sleeping on springs of a bed so so Michelle, how are your feet doing my feet are fine why I was just wondering with all this rain well when it's raining your shoes start to smell kind of bad oh i hadn't noticed i must find out what this pew means every time i appear ah, ah here it is pew it means no, no, not me. <laughs> C'est le ridiculous. Yeah, that was the smell coming out of the bathroom when you were in it. <laughs> <laughs> we stink, we're wet, and we need to keep walking. Vamos. Let's go. You asked me what the Camino provided for me. Uh, it provided some rainforest, <laughs> some rain. It provided me good company. <laughs> there's a castle. There is a castle right there. And, and there's a view. 
I mean, there'd be more of a view if there weren't fog, but I mean, then it might be hot and we'd be complaining about that. So, you know, the Camino also provided thanks to a bus a shorter day. <laughs> There's a weird part of me that kind of likes these rainy walks some days. So weird. He said that as my legs were shivering. It's a um, little chilly, but I mean, I'm not sweating in my raincoat, so that's nice. Do you have an odd sense of humor? We have about a kilometer, kilometer and a half to go to our palace. Let's go. We've made it to our hotel. It has four stars. We're here. We had to climb upstairs. <laughs> Boo. <laughs> but we've arrived to our palace for the night. It's, can you see the sign? Oh, no. you can't see the sign. It's four stars. Now, there now, now is, never ever have we stayed at a four star, Brian. Like, we this have is, not. <gasps> now, there is a Hotel Parador here in this town, <laughs> but it is not a Parador Hotel, it's, which is very different. It's El Parador. They like playing on the word. <laughs> so, as we're coming in, we hear applause because I think there's a wedding reception going on and the stinky pilgrims are about to go crash it. We aren't dressed for that. Here's my problem all the time with like when we have expectations like this is I'm worried about what's going to happen because we have had expectations that have been seriously Well, I mean, let's face it. Task. We got the pilgrim rate, not the deluxe suite. <laughs> we asked for the pilgrim rate, which is the same rate as what I saw on their website. So if that means we get a crappy room, I'm going to be sad. I'm sorry. I'm going to be grateful. We'll see what happens. Let's, let's go, go inside. This is the Camino Real. A royal Camino. <laughs> but you know what, Brian? Hey, we still have to go outside to go to the restaurant. <sighs> he said he would borrow umbrellas for us. <laughs> Did we look? I must have looked pathetic. <laughs> for now, we have to go to the third floor. It's the floor that's apparently the most quiet. I'll take it. Um, you're not dressed like the butler I ordered. <laughs> Look, come on in. <laughs> wow. That's not even the whole room. Wait, wait, let me hide from you. Where are you going? <laughs> whole other area. This means, you know what we, this, you know what the best part about this room? We can hang up a really big clothesline. <laughs> a really big clothesline. <laughs> come over here, let's see. Oh. This is where you put the baby, and then you close the curtain, and the baby can sleep in here. Oh, okay. Oh, there's our view. We do have a view. I mean, ish. I mean, if it stopped raining. There's a playground. Mm. So then that's the building where the restaurant is. Yep. Okay. Okay. You know what? At 8.30 when we're eating, no one else will be there. Yeah, it'll be so early. So early. We got, he said, you have the first dinner time. <laughs> At 8.30 p.m., people. <laughs> 8.30. Our Camino Real has come to a close. It's been a really nice day. I mean, we walked, how many kilometers did we walk? Like six. No. Like six. Like, I'm going to go with nine. <laughs> we'll round up. <laughs> we'll round up we to walked 10. 35 kilometers. <laughs> Listen, if you're watching us, it's because you're following for the adventure, not for the kilometers. And we thank you so much for that. It was a nice day to walk some, walk the hill, walk a lot of rain, walk some mud, walk some more, um, walked into, and you don't know this because we couldn't film it, but when we walked into our hotel, we walked into a wedding party. I like, filmed a little bit of Oh gosh. I mean, like I was embarrassed because I looked like, I mean, I was drenched from head to toe. My shoes are still drying out. Um, 
we and had a pretty dinner. We had, like, we had an amazing four-course dinner that was not a menu del peregrino. No, it was delicious. The best tuna I've had, honestly, this entire trip. Like, the whole, the whole meal was fantastic. And now, I think it's the first sunset I've seen. Have you We're seen? usually in bed by sunset, so... Uh, first sunset we've seen the entire summer. We have two count them two weeks to santiago 14 more walking days and we are in santiago so um hopefully it's gonna get warmer because tomorrow the high is 64. i feel like we're walking like minnesota weather but at the same time it's rainforest so it's wet it's wet so it's like so northern wet. california today northern. all that all that rain we walked through today and it rained the entire time hey i think we should. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Go up there to that party. What do you think? I'm going to bed. I see yeah. disco lights. And... 20 kilometers, and we're actually going to walk 20 kilometers tomorrow. And five, come from five hills to walk tomorrow. I think you underestimated the hills. Maybe there's six. It's going to be a, it's going to be a day. Oh, come on. <laughs> Let's go to bed. Good night, everybody. Ciao.